Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Engine development as you all might be aware is the most complex engineering work that requires expertise as well as experience in metallurgy. India operates thousands of main battle tanks which are powered by engines exported from foreign nations. For example, the indigenous Arjun tank is powered by a German-made MTU liquid-cooled turbocharged diesel engine of 1400 horsepower. The demand for these engines is huge in Indian military and we have to spend millions of dollars in exporting and their maintenance. Last year, the chairman and managing director of BML has confirmed that the firm has taken up a project for design, development and supply of 1500 horsepower engine to CVRD with end user being Indian Army. The engine will be supplied to use on future main battle tank and is designed to work in extreme environmental condition. This will be India's first high-powered 1500 horsepower engine. Now the good news is that BML has started working on the engine. On 8th July, BML has inaugurated their engine design and development center at their Masur complex which will be the center for the development of 1500 horsepower engine along with other engines. BML will supply these engines to CVRD of DRDO who is responsible for the production of Arjun MBT and licensed manufacture of Russian tanks such as T90 Bison. The 1500 horsepower engine on which BML is working will be 1500 horsepower Bharat power pack developed by CVRD for the next generation main battle tank program and future inventory vehicles of Indian Army. The work on the engine has started way back in 2010. Last year, CVRD has planned various ground trials for the main engine along with the turbocharger after which the engine was to be integrated with old Arjun main battle tank prototype. Post integration with Arjun MBT prototype, the engine was planned to go through various testing but there is no further news on this. Talking about Bharat power pack, it will replace the current 1400 horsepower Euro power pack based on German M2 series of engine in Arjun tank. The engine is almost two-thirds in size compared to the existing Arjun's tanks engine. Bharat power pack will come with transmission system that includes a cooling system, air filtration, preheater, turbocharger, electrical system and power management and can be further customized for desert or high altitude operation depending upon the user requirements. Now the benefit of indigenous engine will be that they are designed to perform optimally under the Indian condition, be it desert or high altitude. Bharat Power Pack is a compact, light, efficient and state-of-art diesel engine that runs on DHPP high-speed diesel A with only 50 ppm sulfur particle. This engine will be capable of operating at an altitude of up to 16,400 feet and temperatures as low as minus 20 degrees Celsius and as high as 52 degrees Celsius. The Bharat Power Pack will have some changes in engine control unit and can also be used for the amphibious vehicle and will also be adapted to power the next generation infantry fighting vehicle. The Bharat Power Pack will have weight of around 2200 kgs including coolant and oil that makes it little heavier than the other modern power packs that are usually around 2000 kg for the same horsepower generation. However, the production variant will likely see reduced weight after several improvements that are being planned before it enters the production. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.